falling off late Maybe we just ain't been on the same page In my mind I'm down by In your heart you keep trying and The truth is I hide That's just the way we are but Can't say you love me when it's like that Can't say I love you when it's like that If it was new it won't be like that to everybody else, it won't just hold me back But I love when we make up like that And you love it when I make you mad But maybe we just love like that Yeah, maybe we just love like that Sometimes I don't want you around You do something to make me smile And it's hard for me to try to stop this feeling Okay, guys, I am all out the shower right now I'm gonna go put and do my lashes. Okay, so this is what I use. I use the Fat Lash Cluster Lashes with this Fat Fan Cluster Glue. And then I use these two tweezer things. I'm gonna put the glue on the back of this paper right here. I look a little bit crazy right now. I literally look like a little baby girl without lashes, but I am going to do them right now. Okay guys, so the first thing that I use is this eyelash curler and I'm gonna curl my lashes. I'm not gonna lie, this glue is really strong. So use at your own freaking wrist, you guys. Like, I've ripped out a couple lashes trying to take these off. And after I put these last ones on, I'm gonna try the latest glue. I'll put a little insert clip here of the glue that I'm gonna try and use. Let's put these lashes on, girl. Sir, I did not end up doing my cluster lashes. These are strip lashes. I was um, on the phone and talking with my sister and I was telling her that the glue that I use, I'm kind of scared to use it because it literally rips out my lashes. It's not that it rips out my lashes. I just like after the two week, two week mark, I want new lashes. So I rip them out, but like I'm not patient with it at all. And the last time I took them out, I literally ripped like 20 lashes off this side and like 15 lashes off this side and it literally like hurt my heart because i've always had like really like a lot of lashes i'm gonna put these strips on and then i just bought this off amazon which it's the bond and seal that my sister uses so it's this bond and seal so it's gonna come in tomorrow so as soon as it comes in still in this vlog i'm going to use it and see how my lashes come out i didn't even share with you guys what i wanted to do in this video as you guys know i am a stay at home girlfriend meaning i obviously do a lot of things like side things i do youtube and all of that stuff but overall i am really blessed enough to be able to say that it has literally been busting his butt and working hard and he's been like mentally physically financially like just taking care of me as a whole while i'm able to follow my dreams and i'm just like i'm just very grateful for that at the end of this month i am actually going back to work and testing out the waters and see what i can juggle with having a full-time job doing content creation doing my three other businesses on the side so i'm gonna see what works and what doesn't work and i'm gonna be really tested girl because i'm already kind of like exhausted and youtube content creation is actually like a lot of work but with the full-time job i have not experienced that so we're just gonna see girl i used to work 80 hours a week for a company that didn't give a crap about me i'm gonna have a 40 hour week just with uh, my full-time job so i'm like if you can work 80 hours a week for another company you can put in that time for your job with making money and then um doing my youtube and content creation so yeah you guys i want you guys to see what i do as a stay-at-home girlfriend while um babe is at work it is already 12 p.m i woke up at 5 a.m this morning to make him his breakfast and all of that stuff which i will do tomorrow morning so i'll include that in this vlog i just try and keep myself busy i'm obviously filming and doing things like that editing while i'm not taking care of the household let's go downstairs and make some breakfast slash lunch whatever i do have some 
rice that I made yesterday. So I'm gonna eat that with some um, spam and some like an egg. We're gonna do that for breakfast because that sounds good with a little bit of soy sauce. Yummy! Okay guys, it is all done now. I am literally so excited to eat because I'm starving. I could have made fried rice, but I just don't have energy right now to do all of that. I want to talk a little bit how I even became or how this even whole stay at home girlfriend thing even happened because since I started my channel all you guys have seen is like me on my channel me vlogging my life and like not really seeing the behind the scenes of how we even got I'm sorry short the journey we took to where I was even able to start staying home and not have to physically leave for a full-time job or even work from home like as a full-time job like I used to. In October of 2020, me and Aunt actually got hired at the same exact job and we were getting paid a lot. There was a lot of overtime opportunities and all of that stuff and I'm such a workaholic that like when I get opportunity to be like an opportunity to do like time and a half or like work on holidays for like overtime like double pay and all of this stuff, I would always do it. So I was working minimum like 75 to 80 hours a week so during the span of me working all of these hours in 2022 is when babe got let go of his job the stay-at-home job that we were working he got let go just because the company was doing like budget cuts after babe got let go i was like oh my god what are we gonna do we were living with my sister at the time but we were like five, six months out of getting our house that we're in now. So I was like super scared, but I was like, you know what? Like I'm, I still have the job. I'm gonna bust my ass still and work so much to where like we can still do it. He ended up getting, um, working part-time at a smoke shop for like a week and then he got this solar job. I was always very used to like making a lot of money, you guys, like when I say, I'm not, I'm I'm like expressing this and I'm saying it because of how much now like I'm realizing like holy crap girl like the amount of money that I was blessed with obviously I was working hard for but you don't just make that money like that money is like a crazy amount of money that I can make I was like paying my bills I was paying my bills saving for our house plus like taking care of like our needs and like it was it was just super crazy we had actually got the keys to our house in December and in December I had taken two weeks off so I was off the last two weeks of December coming into like the first three days of January and in January when I came back from work I had came back on a Monday I had worked that Monday and um, everything was cool like I was back at work getting in my groove like I had my office set up and everything like that and then as soon as I woke up the next day for work, I was locked out of everything. Like I didn't have passwords to anything. I was not able to get into like, even to, to even clock in you guys, I couldn't get into anything. And I remember asking my manager, like I called her and I was like, hey, like I'm trying to clock in and I'm trying to get into all of my systems, but I can't. She was like, oh, like that's so weird. Let me like see what's going on. Long story short, they didn't even end up telling her that they were letting me go like i was one of the last large people like to go it was like a very unfortunate situation and i was honestly really scared because i've always made so much money and brought in income and i've never not worked like since i started working i had barely um was a couple months into solar and yeah he was making amazing money like he was matching what i was making at my other job so like us having those dual incomes was gonna be like crazy, you know? But now that I, since I had gotten let go in January, I was like, okay, I'm gonna take this time 
to focus on my dreams and do it. And I've been wanting to do YouTube for so long and I finally was able to do it. I remember talking to my sister and my sister was literally like, you've been in your house for a week, why haven't you uploaded your, new, your first video? And I literally was like, girl, like I just zoomed in, like what the hell? She was like, no, you were working 80 hours a week for a job that didn't care for you. So when I got laid off in January after that, um, and I started like YouTube and stuff, I actually was on unemployment and I gave myself this opportunity to follow my dreams and like keep going and stuff. So it was like a really good, so I was bringing in income still. I just wasn't bringing in the income that I was bringing in before. Long story short, I've been a stay at home girlfriend for like seven months now. I'm gonna put everything that I got and he gonna put everything he got and we're gonna be okay. I feel like I waited way too long to eat cause I have a headache right now. I'm trying to decide what I want to make for dinner, but I need to wash dishes first. Okay guys, I just talked to Aunt. He is eating right now with the boys. I'm gonna go ahead and do the dishes. That way, when I cook dinner time, the kitchen is all clean. I'm trying to figure out what to do for dinner. I'm not sure if I want to do like a pasta or I don't know. I haven't ate pasta in a really long time, so I think I might do that. I just have to see if we Want it with some meat? Yeah, we could just walk away. Yeah, we could just stay away. The things I love about you, I can't change. No, 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 no. Okay, guys, I am literally gonna go upstairs and watch Kane like a hawk. Um, he has been a bad boy today, literally like ripping up the carpets and stuff. So I'm going to go up there until babe gets home and just watch him because I am, <sighs> he's just been bad and it's not like he doesn't have any toys to play with or anything like that. I don't know. It's, I don't know. I'm frustrated and I'm going to go watch him. A babe is home, but we literally rushed out of the house because we had to go drop off a package at UPS and they closed in approximately 17. 17 minutes. The last clip you guys seen is me stressed out because Kane um, tore up my damn carpet. That would be crazy. He's still paying for it right now because I'm just like really upset at him. And I told babe that he had to deal with him, but it, he got him, he had a talk with him. Do you think he understood your talk? I'm pretty sure. Hopefully. Well, and when you're a stay-at-home girlfriend, you know that SpongeBob thing where it's like, well, what do you do when I go to work? Wait for you to come home? <laughs> From SpongeBob and Patrick. I haven't, but I can, I can see him talking, doing that. Yeah, that's me. I'd just be waiting for him to come home. Why would we get that if Starbucks is right here? And the same fucking price, no. no Hell, no. Dutch Bros. <gasps> Starbucks is still more expensive than Dutch Bros. Oh, is it? Yeah. W Dutch Bros was still L. 50% W. Just because, like, why you boost the price up? Like, you already know your gas. Like, there's no reason to. Yeah, do Stop that. being money hungry. If that's what it is. I remember going to Dutch Bros and the drinks used to be like not that. Or you can get like five drinks for like ten bucks. Yeah. Okay guys, we're at Dutch Brothers. I just put up take off what the fuck do I be saying, bro? I just took my sweater off because it's a little bit too hot for that stuff. Good, okay, sorry for you. Can I have a small um camera for your face? Thank you. You as well. What's your view on how I've been like a stay at home girlfriend? I think you're amazing because you watch out for King and like the house is always clean. My stomach always full. But you know what I like about At is that he doesn't expect me to do those things. He doesn't expect me to clean. He doesn't expect me to cook. Like, I do it because I feel like he, like, respects 
me to where I want to do those things for him. You get what I mean? Because I feel like if you expected it, I wouldn't do it. Because that's just fucked up. You don't expect something from people, like, no matter their circumstance or, like, Not anything. Sure. So I feel like the way that you, like, let me do whatever I want. But obviously, like, I love a clean house. I love to cook, like, dinner and stuff like that. So. Mm-hmm. Ain't your food be fire. What? Ain't your food be fire. I heard you the first time. I just want to hear it again. That's crazy. <laughs> I run out the house with a full jumpsuit on and, um... A zip up, not realizing like it's fucking summer. A thousand degrees outside, but my house is so cold, so I like kind of forgot. Like I'm a little subtle for goodness. I was telling them how like I've even became a stay at home girlfriend, but like how before I was like making hella money and like busting my ass and shit. So I wasn't like always a bum. I'm not a bum now. Like, I'm really not a bum. Do you think I'm He's a bum? He's never a bum. What are you talking about? Well, no, that's just like a funny joke to say. Like, oh. I'm not a bum now. But I mean, you're a I, bum. No, that's you're like a me bum. Calling you no, like, you're physically a bum. That's like me calling you You look a, like I mean, a bum. Sorry. Went to war. Are you going to tell them I made more money than you back then? She did. Again, can't believe it. That was my original plan. I told her it was that, like... I'm gonna make sure all the bills go. I'll let you know. Yeah. Hi guys. Hi. Do you guys want a uh, straw or a carrier? Um, both, please. Okay, Thank you. Yeah, I'll let you know. I'm gonna make sure all the bills scrape. I need another trip. <laughs> but he's told me this since, like, way before he even had this, like, amazing job or anything. So he's always. Back when been, we was in high school. Back yeah. when, we, when we first got together, I've been told her what my point was. Yeah. And unexpectedly, he fulfilled that. 80 stickers fired. They are, right? Shut up, Dutch Bros. I never receive stickers. We never come on sticker day. Oh, <gasps> Why the fuck do we not come on sticker day? I, I don't know, babe. Well. Oh, these are small. Those are mine, yeah. Those are smalls. Those are mediums. Ew, why did you get a small? That's ugly. Every time we go to Dutch Bros, babe always is like, hey, yo, in there? Mm-hmm. Can I make this and this and this like all the time? Yeah. It never fails. Look, so this grapefruit coconut, but the taste it though. Yeah. Which is what I'm about to do. Right after this episode. No, I'm <laughs> Not to right after this episode. Do you like it? Let me see. That's good. And what's the other one you got? It's a lemonade. Marmalade? Marmalade, which is a grapefruit, <laughs> strawberry, oh, gatefruit? gatefruit, strawberry, orange. Oh, period. All the fruits. Period. Oh, that's good. And then I got a caramelizer and a palm beach lemonade. Like what? Car- Did I hear caramel? Get your mouth off it. It was leaking. I had to. It was not leaking. Look, it's. I put my pajamas on because um, I was just too tired of wearing that jumpsuit. But I'm gonna cook some dinner. I cook a really really easy dinner tonight because I didn't take out any meat, and it's okay because we haven't ate pasta in a really long time. And I got this three cheese Trader Joe sauce. I also got these noodles from Trader Joe's and. I'm gonna use that with some Parmesan cheese and this, some quick and easy. So I used about half the pack of noodles. Usually when I make pasta, I make like the whole box or like even 75% of the box and me and him never finish it. So I'm making half today and that should be more than enough for it to be super saucy with this. Top the roof and let the smoke clear. I got diamonds to it to see slides in both kids. Dice rolling on the Las Vegas trip tonight. Slip that on and we might just the fight. Okay, you guys, dinner is all done. I called Babe down like five minutes ago. He hasn't came, so I'm gonna start eating by myself.
one of mine when she tattooed that ass. I'm a lover boy. She got her toys. Keep it coming, you a rider. Just that roll myself a day and count my figures. Well, I'm already done eating. I told you to come down a long time ago. It's the stepping out, I feel like I'm that nigga shit. I drop 30 on this room, we ain't gonna sleep for shit. If I catch you not enough, then it's gonna be dinner was super good. I am gonna go lay down now with babe and watch a show. I We'll catch you guys tomorrow morning. I'm gonna do more stay-at-home girlfriend stuff. We're gonna wake up at 5 a.m. So I can make babes breakfast and get him ready and send him off to work. So I will catch you guys at 5 a.m. Sure. More like 4.50. I'm so tired. So I usually make him... Um, Depending on his job, I have, depending on how many, like, how big his job is, he'll take, like, lunch or breakfast or, like, snacks, whatever. But since his job is not that big, he just wants breakfast. And honestly, I ask him every um, night what he wants for breakfast in the morning. That way I don't just make something that he's not going to eat. He wants oatmeal. I'm gonna put it in this um, hydro flask that way it can stay warm. Mmm, so good. So this was a really fast and easy breakfast this morning. Usually um, I make him like a breakfast burrito, breakfast sandwich, Something like that, but he's been craving oatmeal for breakfast. So it's been easier on me, girl. And the job he does, I said it in another vlog, but he does take an energy drink every day. So I'm gonna leave this here. And then I give him um, Gator Eats. Having him take his stuff in a tote bag, but he left the tote bag at work for the second day in a row. So I don't have it. And then we got him a lunchbox. It just hasn't, uh, we just haven't picked it up yet. So he's taking this. Boy, it is 5 o'clock in the morning. This is me at 5 o'clock in the morning. Is anybody else, like, boyfriends like that? Like, they're like, alarm goes off, and then they're like, ready for the day. Ready? Like, <sighs> All right, not me. Huh? Are you taking your car? Mm-hmm. Hopefully you just That's why I didn't leave the house yesterday, you guys, because babe took my car, and honestly, I was going to go and, like, try and get out of the house today. I'm going to be home uh, sooner. Um. <clears throat> Every time he says that, he comes home at five. Then I'll take care of cleaning everything and you can go. This is my favorite person. This babe is leaving right now. Honestly? What? I think it's told back me. You know, some really good people would be like, wow, I just woke up at five, started my day, you know, stay awake. Mm -hmm. 
I'm going back to sleep because my sleeping schedule is so messed up that I fall asleep so late. I am obviously trying to fix it now that I am going back to work, but I'm like, <sighs> you know, I am going back to bed. That's probably why my sleeping schedule is so bad, but I will catch you guys in a little bit in like three to four hours when I officially wake up. <sighs> okay, you guys, I just officially got up i woke up around 9 30 but i stay in bed on my phone scrolling and stuff so it is now 10 30 i'm going to like actually get up do the bed peep on my neighbors so this august i've been telling myself that i want to get up and get myself ready for the day instead of looking like this all day there's nothing wrong with that but i just feel like i feel more productive and i want to get up and do more when i have my hair done and like a cute little like outfit not even like going out outfit just like a cute bumper right now i am going to do my hair get changed and then we're gonna go downstairs for some brekkie <laughs> my hair is all done i just put like a little bit of curls in there and then i also changed my outfit i'm just wearing this little um romper zip up because my house is super cold girl but i'm just waiting for kane to go potty that way i can go downstairs and feed me okay guys so we made it downstairs i'm going to make myself a breakfast um english muffin sandwich with some ham egg and cheese i usually use the american cheese which i have it but babe said that the swiss cheese is really good so i'm gonna try it my breakfast sandwich is done and i'm so excited to eat You guys, as you guys can see, my wonderful boyfriend just came home and I'm gonna start my period in like tomorrow. And he got me my cravings. I was craving a chocolate donut with some hot fries, stale of course. And then he actually went to my sister's house to go pick up all of my packages so i'm gonna open them right now with you guys as well you guys so this is the first thing that i got <laughs> okay on camera it looks really bad but on bad. on my body it won't look bad i promise and honestly i have to try it on to see if i even like it but babe says that i kind of look like a what a caca what a trash bag a a, it looks a, like a caca a poop, trash bag, a caca trash bag. <laughs> And then I also got this one. This is like a blue skirt. And then this is the top. Nice, reasonable color. You like the color? Love it. Better than the last one. But this top comes with this sleeve on this <laughs> side. So it's kind of like cute, you know? No, I do like that. Thank you. I'm glad you like something. I like a lot of things that you pick. It's just... Oh, these are yours. There's always those one few, like, one to two ones that you order that's just like what the fuck is going on here and then these are babes we're actually do going to a pool party on saturday so those are going to be and then i got this this is like a cover-up for the pool girl this was like one dollar period and then i got this so i can tan this is the top. These are the bottoms. Uh, babe, get out of here because you're making me nervous because this is like... Are you nervous? You like me? Yeah. 
And then this is, it kind of looks weird because there's a bunch of strings, but this is the front of it. And then these are like the bottoms. I have to try all of these on. Oh, and look, I got these things that make my buttons, um, my, my buttons, like I could tighten my jeans without worrying about. Well, you can do what you wanna live how you wanna spin what you wanna be who you wanna be the young stutter to the you can do what you wanna live how you wanna spin what you wanna be who you wanna be hey guys so the ground beef is cooking right now as you guys seen i cut up some potato and onion because on the side i'm going to make my tacos dorados with some onion and potato. Babe doesn't like this stuff, so I have to make two separate ones. Guys, <laughs> my tacos are already done. I made mine with the potatoes and onions, and then I put some guac, green salsa, sour cream, and cotija cheese. Yumsters! okay guys dinner was super freaking good but now i'm going to put some lashes on so i am going to use this bond and seal but i'm gonna also use the other glue like on top basically i'm gonna mix it and Karina told me, like, girl, we're not going to force them off this time. You won't lose any lashes. I just need to be smarter with them. So I'm going to do my latches. And I'm going swimming, girl. So I'm going to need these to last last. My lashes are all done. I am so happy I went with these ones because the glue stuck super good. And I didn't know if I was going to swim and then come right off with the other one. And I like deep dive swimming in these glues. In these glues, girl. But yeah, I am super happy with the way they turned out. I am going to call it a night. I hope you guys did enjoy this video. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing a little bit more and what I do as a stay-at-home girlfriend not for long i'm just kidding but yeah i am going to call it a night i hope you guys did enjoy watching today's video don't forget to like comment share and subscribe don't fake and i'll catch you guys on the next vlog bye